This video is based on the Pelican technical article by Wayne Dempsey, how to perform an oil change on a BMW E30. One of the most common tasks to perform is replacing your engine oil. Frequent oil changes are supposedly the most important thing you can do to maintain and prolong the life of your engine. The first thing you need to do is to make sure that you have everything that is required for the job. The E30 model requires 3.5 to 4.2 quarts of oil, an oil filter, 13 and 17 millimeter wrenches, a roll of paper towels, and a very large oil pan. Start by driving the car around and letting it heat up to operating temperature. You want to empty your oil when it's hot because the heat makes the oil flow a lot easier and more particles of metal and dirt will come out when the oil is empty. Once you get your car parked, place the oil pan bucket underneath the oil tank of the car. At the bottom of the engine sump, there is a plug that is used for draining oil. Remove this plug carefully. This is a good time to remove the oil filter. On E30 cars, the filter is a complete unit with an outer metal housing. This filter should only be screwed on finger tight, but you may need a filter wrench to remove it. Be aware though that this method will leak oil out of the filter into your engine compartment, so have some paper towels handy. For the E30 cars, install the oil filter with the seal wet. Wipe a small bit of oil on a paper towel and use it to make sure that there is oil on the seal all the way around the filter. Screw on the filter and make it snug tight. No need to use the iron grip of death when tightening the oil filter. These don't have a tendency to leak. Add about four quarts to the engine and check the dipstick. Continue to add about a half a quart at a time and keep checking the dipstick. Fill it up until it reaches the top mark of the dipstick. The engine oil level will automatically lower when the oil filter fills up with oil. Make sure that you put the oil filler cap back on the top of the valve cover, otherwise you'll end up with a messy engine compartment when you drive away. Well there you have it, it's really not too difficult at all. If you'd like to see more technical articles like this one, Please continue to support Pelican Parts with all of your parts needs.